Sup guys, let's do this. <laughs> What is up you guys, Claudio back again with another reaction and this time we have Volvo Dinia Flesh Taylor. This is a music video. I normally don't do music videos but um, for this one I had to do it. I felt at least this is a slam metal apparently this is like a new form of metal where everything is really over the top and i'm really curious about it to be honest this was suggested by this guy over here uh anime metal viking uh check out his channel he does uh, ruby reviews and uh, reactions and some metal reviews as well so he's a really cool guy so check out his channel i'm gonna leave the link below as well as for this video so now you know that and uh, yeah man I am very interested in slam metal. Um, I listen to death metal. I listen to punk, hardcore, all, all types of metal and like guitar-driven uh, music. Anyway, rock as well, obviously. And uh, I never really listened to this. I never really, never really given this a chance. And I thought it'd be fair. And since uh, he suggested it, I thought, why not? So let's watch it and. Uh, and just, I don't know, let's see what's up. Let's do this. Pop! All right. Typical names where you can't I'm see what it spells. Tear the skin from your body. Slowly. This is probably gonna be gory as hell. Everything is down tuned. It's like seven, three, eight string guitars. <laughs> this is so extreme. It's. <laughs> wow. L listen at the kick drum and the blast beats and they have pieces of meat hanging around it's <laughs> what the fuck Oh my god, the drummer. <laughs> yeah, they do this pig squeals. Sounds like a pig being slaughtered, to be honest. And that's the point, I believe. I, I, the, the, the kick drums, they're insane. I don't know what BPM they're at, but it's like, they're really going. Even though it's really fucking brutal and, you know, gory like that, it still has a pretty nice, uh, BPM, a really nice rhythm, you know what I mean? Whew. <laughs> Man. Thoughts. Yeah, guys. Um, 
What can we say about this? This is um This is like It's more This is more fitting to music to have to like a game uh like you know doom you know this guy who did the doom music kind of instrumental very down tuned uh done a few reactions to his stuff it's really cool this was more fitting to 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 the whole slaughter that is doom to be honest this uh was really not that melodic as uh, probably the other stuff is but still it's this is slam. So now we learn something new, boys and girls. Say after me, slam metal. Now we know that. It's fucking insane. I've heard stuff similar to this. Um, I mean, uh, when I was younger, we listened to Cannibal Corpse and bands like that. But this is a, a step further, I think. Uh, it's... Uh, I don't know, man. It's <laughs> it's just fucking. You know what? What can you say about this? Uh, first off, like as a musician, since I play guitar and bass and drum and all that stuff, uh, the drummer. It's if that's a human being playing at that BPM with the double kicks, it's fucking insane. Uh, the blast beats on the snare were really tight as well. Kind of a high pitch snare sounded kind of like a piccolo snare just to make the hits really distinctive so that was kind of cool and kind of clever of the producer or technician or whoever was working their sound because otherwise otherwise it sounds really like a fucking mess it's really difficult to distinguish what it was if it's too like that you know yeah but in this case no very clear sounding even though the music was brutal uh, down tuned and everything you could kind of hear the uh the groove right uh, this is not nearly as groovy as other bands who do eight string like mashuga for example mashuga is all about the rhythm and all about the groove this not really in the same way but i i could still feel the music you know you have some bands that are all over the place and when you can't distinguish anything this was and i think and i think thanks to the drummer very groove friendly sort of i, I could kind of understand if somebody told me that this is my favorite slam band i would kind of get why they'd say that because it still gives you a, a sense of uh, uh you can still like it and kind of nod your head to it and uh, the pig squeals man it's i mean the whole the whole setting of this video is uh, uh jesus christ it's a slaughterhouse basically and the pig squeal when the guy screams and it sounds like a dying pig it's uh that's a technique i'll never get how they do that uh, I, obviously these guys weren't first doing it or anything, but he does it really good. It sounds fucking brutal. Uh, and that's the whole point of this, I guess. It sounds fucking brutal. Uh, so if that's the, uh, that's where, what they're aiming for, they're right on target. Um, I would like to say that even though I'm not familiar with the genre of slam metal, um... I'm gonna say that this is, uh, I don't know how you could do it better. I'm not saying that this is the best slam band because I, 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 I wouldn't even know where to start to compare them or anything, nor do I have the time to start listening to slam or anything like that, but uh, if you're gonna introduce somebody to, to this type of music, this would be a, a good choice, I think. That is my opinion. And uh, I would like to hear yours if you have uh, something to to add to to the little little analysis I did of this song and the the, the, the music younger you you are uh, more than welcome to do so in the comment section below I would appreciate it actually uh, remember to check out the video 
uh, I leave the link below as well as the link to Adam Metal Viking, the guy who suggested the video. You can check out his videos as well. He's done a bunch of music uh, like uh, reviews and stuff, and he does the Ruby reaction and the occasional reaction to to, to random stuff as well. It's a pretty cool guy. You can check him out there, and I don't know, but just leave a comment. You know, let me know whatever you thought about this. This is. This is very different, and I get it, it's not for everyone, I, I totally understand that. So, uh, I'm not expecting everybody, everybody to, to, be, to be loving this or anything like that, but, but still, g give your input, uh, let me know what y'all think, and uh, thank you for watching and all that good stuff, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video.